Hello everybody, it's David here from the club in Mill Green. Firstly, I wanted to congratulate our ladies Pearson's team for their great win against Hartsbourne on Monday. The weather conditions were really tough, uh, very windy, um, so it was a great win, well deserved. I've got a couple of dates for your diary. Entries for the men's summer knockout singles and doubles will be closing on Monday the 27th of March. I know it's some of your guys' favourite competition of the year, so get your entries in soon. Lastly, but definitely not least, we've got a really fun event for our season opener, uh, foursomes, which will be taking place on the 9th of April. You'll be able to enter from Friday at 7am. We will have live music, prizes, food specials and two for one on selected drinks. I look forward to seeing you all down at the club very soon. Uh, I've got a round booked in myself this weekend, um, so maybe see you out on the course. Good morning, Mill Green. Hope you're well. Just thought I'd bring an update to let you know what we're doing on two fairways today, 5 and 13. Uh, so behind me we have a large heap of greens waste, um, also known as compost. Um, and some of the positive characteristics of compost, it's very nutritious, it retains moisture. Uh, but normally what we do, we use two parts of this greens waste to one part sand. Uh, and we mix in our, our seed with that for our divot mix. Um, and that's typically what we use in our teas to get some recovery through spring, summer and autumn. Uh, but today we're going to be using that greens waste on the 13th and the 5th fairway because of its characteristics, it holds moisture, it's very nutritious. And then two fairways in particular are very weak, they don't have a lot of topsoil on them uh, and no uh, organic matter at all. So we're just obviously trying to replace all that with this stuff here uh, so we can have a better fairway uh, come the summer. What I'll do is I'll top dress one of the fairways and I'll post um, another video to let you know what it looks like afterwards. Thanks guys, cheers. So here we are up on 13. Uh, we've done six passes with the greens waste. You can just see it on, on the ground. Um, it's roughly about six tonne. We're gonna do a couple more passes uh, and get the brush and then just brush it in. Uh, but you can, see, you can really see it but it will do a world of good going forward. Uh, so we're very pleased with that. We are continuing with the Ventrax, uh, cutting all the long rough down the brambles around the golf course. Um, we've also used the power rake attachment to go over all the paths. Uh, so we've rotated all the paths, got rid of all the potholes that was really damaging my machinery. Um, and then we're gonna do it again Monday of next week. And we have a road roller coming in to roll them straight behind, roll them smooth, flat and compact them for the season ahead. Uh, so hopefully it makes the buggy rides nice and smooth uh, and walking on nice and smooth and, and easier on the feet. Um, we've we've done a nice little top dress on the greens this week. Uh, part of our little and often approach. Uh, that's two hits now on the greens. It's roughly about 20 ton of sand we've put out this year. Uh, it's been very minimal. Um, but 20 ton as one big hit is very uh, unpleasant to play on. Um, so the route that we're taking is little enough and really working for uh, my greens here at Mill Green. And um, they're playing pretty well at the minute. I'm very pleased. That's us for this week. Um, and any other details, I'll keep updating you on the members chat. And so I'll see you all soon. Take care.